The Emerald City of Oz is the second collection uh, of the Oz books by L. Frank Baum uh, in this Barnes & Noble Classics uh, leather-bound edition. Um, it is also very pretty. It's, um, it's an emerald green, uh, which is maybe not surprising. Uh, the uh, the edge is silver, and the um, the bookmark is gold. Uh, let me give you a quick overview of this particular edition. Um, now, I managed to find this. Uh, for those of you who don't know, it's actually quite difficult to find this book in publication at a reasonable price. Um, I managed to find it on Amazon.de, the German uh, version of, of Amazon, at al almost retail price. Um, so <laughs> I know that there's there are only a few left, um, and probably after this video those will go pretty fast as well. But uh, if you're interested in getting this second uh, omnibus of the Oz books, uh, listing novels 6 through 10, um, then yep, Amazon.de is one of the ways to get that at the moment. Again, very similar format for the, the sticker on the front. Um, nice... Uh, Nice, nice design. Um, the ruby, the emeralds have been replaced with rubies this time. I suppose they, they pop a bit nice, more a bit more um, against the the green background. Um, and we have uh, some more of that lovely art from inside. Now, a little apology uh, for those of you who saw my um, review of uh, the Wizard of Oz. Uh, the, the yellow book a couple of days ago. I said that uh, all the art in there was from W.W. W. Denslau, but actually, uh, and I was pointing out how how his his art had improved over the over the years, but actually it's uh, uh, it's John R. Neal um, who does uh, the um, this kind of more advanced. Uh, more accomplished art, um, whereas Denslau really set the tone. Um, Neil is the one who seems to have um, to have perfected it. Uh, and in this book, it's essentially it's it's all it's all il illustrations by um, by John R. Neil. Uh, so apologies for that, um, my mistake. Um, but of course, uh, Denslau is listed on the front because this is art by W.W. W. Denslow. So what do you get in, um, in, this, in this book? I have shown you the, the spine already. You get the Emerald City of Oz, the Patchwork Girl of Oz, TikTok of Oz, the Scarecrow of Oz, and Rinky Tink in Oz. When you open the book, uh, you have that table of contents listing the books that I just mentioned, a nice introduction, and we get started straight away with the Emerald City of Oz and the contents page. Let me zoom in a little bit, or rather, come in a little bit onto this illustration. Full of imagination, it's lovely. Nice little detail there.
takes a beat to um, notice what's going on. Once you capture it, it's it's really really beautiful. Again, very nice font, very easy to read. Those lovely uh, chapter headers. Um, very, very nice addition. The paper feels nice and nice and smooth. Um, each book has its title page. End page. No matter the time you get to the end. It's quite dense with illustrations. That's that's really nice. Final illustration. And uh, and yes, and this time the. Uh, pattern which was green on the previous book is yellow. It's a great, um, it's a great addition to the bookshelf as usual with these Barnes and Nobles um, leather-bound editions. As I was saying the other day with the uh, with the Wizard of Oz, the leather is uh, very glossy. Um, and fits very nicely with the other children um, oriented um, books in the series. Hope you like the video. Uh, do drop me a like if you like the video and subscribe um, and I will see you soon.